Welcome to Combiz Markets, the Commonwealth Bank's premier foreign exchange platform. This short video shows how easy it is to add a beneficiary to your Combiz Markets address book. Before you start, you'll need to have your beneficiary's name, address and the following banking details. Their account number, the SWIFT, BIC, ABA or your preferred clearing method. Their bank branch or routing code. If you are sending payments to countries listed on the screen, you'll also need the International Bank Account Number, or IBAN. To log on to Combiz Markets, go to combiz.com.au, click Log On, and enter your login ID and password. If you're a token holder, you'll also need to enter the six-digit token password. Click the Markets tab, and you're ready to begin. To go to your address book, choose Foreign Exchange from the left-hand menu. Then click Address Book. You'll see that Combiz Markets and Combiz Payable share the same address book, making it easy for you to find your beneficiaries and payees information when you need it. Scroll down to the bottom of the page, then click Create New Address. Type the beneficiary's account details in the Account Details field, then enter a name in the Display Name field, the name you'll use to identify this beneficiary in your address book entries. Please note a BSB number is only required if sending funds to Australia. Next, choose an account category from the drop-down menu. Choose overseas for foreign currency accounts that are based offshore or domestic foreign currency if you're paying to a foreign currency account based in Australia. Choose the purpose from the drop-down menu. Click the currency field under the banking details heading. You can then choose the beneficiary's account currency from the drop-down menu. Choose the Beneficiary Bank Details by clicking on the hyperlink under the Beneficiary Bank Details heading. Click Country and choose the name of your beneficiary's country from the drop-down menu. If you have your beneficiary's bank code, type it into the Bank Code field. Then click the yellow search button. If you don't have a bank code, Combiz Markets can help you find it. Simply choose the country, enter the name and city of your beneficiary's bank and then click the search button. Click on the button for the Beneficiaries Bank, then click Select. Your Beneficiaries Bank details will appear automatically. You can also add the Intermediary Bank details if you have them by repeating these steps in the Intermediary Bank Details field. You're nearly there, but first, you'll need to type in your Beneficiaries Address details, as required by anti-money laundering legislation. And remember, with Combiz Markets, you're in complete control of who receives remittance advices and when. So there's no need to complete the remittance details, company details and contact details here. Instead, you'll generate the settlement confirmation in Combiz Markets and send it directly to your beneficiary. Once you're done, click on Add Address. You'll be able to add multiple address book entries in the same flow by entering the details of the next beneficiary in the same manner and clicking Add Address. When you've finished adding the new beneficiaries, click Save. Check that all the information is correct. Click on Cancel if you need to make any changes. If all the information is correct and you are a token holder, please enter your login ID, login password and token password and click Confirm. If you're not a token holder, an active token holder with adequate permissions will need to approve the new address book entry before you can use it. Once it's approved, you can use your new entry whenever you need to make a foreign exchange payment to this beneficiary, saving you time and effort every time. Finally, if you need to search for your beneficiary, please type the display name, select the account category and click search. And remember, if you have any questions, our dedicated Combiz Market support team is here to help. Thank you for using Combiz Markets.